You mate are a fucking haggis snorting, faggot orphan. Haggis snorting, faggot orphan. Your dad's a Mormon and your nan's a doorman. <laughs> Hey, we're here, Revival 7, main event number one of the afternoon. Manchester, please make some noise for the main event. Let's go. Yes. Shouts to Bobby Rex getting changed, turning this into Babe Station. We're about to get into the battle straight away. MC on my right hand side. I'm going to say, first time officially on camera, definitely in the running for a second title shot. O'Shea, make some noise. I don't want that title back today. Go on. Put you in the fucking battle, you'll do it, mate. That's I it. Will do. All right, I will do. on the left hand side, exactly. <laughs> on the left hand side, he officially is the best newcomer of 2016. It was an amazing battle. My man, hey, Bobby hey, Ricks. Hey, 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 he sold it. He sold out an entire friendship to win a fucking battle, and that's what it's about. That is what Dope Club is all about. Friendship means nothing, but imaginary titles mean everything. Yeah. Yeah. We're about to get into this next battle. Osh won the flip, and he chose to go first. It is round number one on my man Osh. Let's go. What is your real name, Bobby Rex? <laughs> Listen, I'll leave Bobby as happy as Larry. That ain't your real name. What's his real name? It's Barry. Yeah. yeah. Listen. <laughs> with Bobby Rex, so already this matchup has got me vexed. See, I've done four battles in four weekends, I've been proper stressed, so I'll let you stinking man cunts know right off the bat. <laughs> 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 Rex, listen, 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 I'll let you smelly man cunts know right off the bat. This shit is not me best, but I'm still here because I needed cash more and I'm not depressed. Listen, <laughs> shout out Pete. I'm O'Shea, born winner. I eat four dinners before dinner. <laughs> Floor filler, natural born killer. White boy with gangster laughs like Scorzilla. Whereas the you, Bobby Rex, you big bald bastard. Listen, <laughs> the difference between me and you is I got big balls, massive. On some, on some next hype shit, I will flip your mattress, hit them with a left, right, quick, and watch this prick fall backwards. Do you think I give a shit if you're six four faggot? I will run up in your cloakroom and nick your jacket. <laughs> Poor, pure spastic, one newcomer of the year 2016. But to me, that's no accomplishment. Yes, he thinks he's rose in prominence. But listen, you've just become overconfident from loads of compliments. If he'd been doing it since we've been doing it, you've had more L's on your board than a load of consonants. Listen, <laughs> listen you're known in Manny, I'm known over consonants. Oh, shit. Yeah. When, I, when I speak, People lay reeves at my feet, like a dead soldier's monument. <laughs> Where the fuck is Dom? He's meant to lay a reef then. <laughs> that just genuinely didn't work. Listen, <laughs> he's meant to drop that. Listen, I ain't fucking about. You get punched in the mouth. You go on plenty of fish, looking for trout. <laughs> That my man's rhyming is kind of tight, but this new title that you've got has got you blinded by the light. Newcomer of the year should be best of a bad bunch, and by a bad, <laughs> by a bad, bad <laughs> bad light, best of a bad bunch, and by a bad bunch I mean a pile of shite. <laughs> Listen, this guy is 30 plus years old and has just won newcomer of the year. <laughs> what fucked up bus route did you use to get here? <laughs> Continue with your dreams, lad. <laughs> Cause I'm awful sure. Don't flop a 31 KOTD debut, 44. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this hippie, URL, 60. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> this Bell and Bobby's favourite tune it's Justin Bieber's baby. <laughs> I said to Bobby before the battle, do you want a bevy? Guess what this man cunt said? He said, maybe! <laughs> 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 
Bobby, let's go. Round one, let's go, Bobby. Let's go. Let's go, Bobby. Said he eats four dinners before dinner. Yeah. Like, that's the kind of line that could hurt me. I eat Sunday dinner on a Thursday. <laughs> Bring the mask, no turkey! <laughs> Don't go. <laughs> Legend status. Thank him. He's one of the best. That, he's one of the best that's ever stepped on stage to entertain you. Sets a relentless pace with every sentence sprayed. Such an inventive brain that constantly pens the best of phrases. He knows a thousand different ways of how to ask you, can he lend you trainers? <laughs> recognised in the streets now and gets to pretend he's famous although I'm not really sure that counts when it's just his fucking friends and neighbours <laughs> <laughs> in real life the guy's a bum hasn't put any money towards the rent for ages spends his wages going to events on day trips just to get some love and attention and to try and impress some strangers <laughs> 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 Of all time, it's Bobby Red! <laughs> nah, I'm joking. <laughs> don't flatter yourself, folks. I don't care for your reputation. I just came here to enhance mine, so I took care with the preparation. Mm. I brought nothing but similes wrapped in metaphors, disguised as triple entendres. <laughs> <laughs> so when I say shit like, I'm just here to find out whether I'm good enough to reign over the game and make you all hail to the name, just know. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm actually trying to say to you is that my willer is humongous. <laughs> yeah, so go and tell your fucking girlfriends. <laughs> say, hey, you silly little blonde bitch. Bobby said he's got a big cock and you can sit on it if you want it. I grabbed that whore and bang her from behind while singing Glory Glory Man United. <laughs> Mondays for the soundtrack and then released the DVD called Have Some of That You Scruffy Scout <laughs> See old, old Shea came here to clown on me I came here to out rap and out perform him and you're damn right I'm gonna shout at him and that could happen at any fucking minute <laughs> without any prior warning you might be, <laughs> you might be the man in here but in real life, I am more than you will ever be. I am a lion when it's roaring. You're more like a dandelion. And you'll get your head took off like it's a fight between a giant and a dwarf. I'm Bobby Rex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Bobby Rex. <laughs> and I'm the type of guy that's boring. No, I'm not. <laughs> but I'm glad that they recognized Bobby Rex is doing good. I think it's time that we reward him. Give him old Shay, because he's so great. Um, anybody there? Remember my next bar? No? Oh. Oh. Then wait. <laughs> I'm Bobby Rex. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ah, oh, what is it? I can't believe it. <laughs> You got it, mate. Now get your head took off like it's a fight between a giant and a dwarf. I'm Bobby Rex. Can't remember it. Not impressed. <laughs> Not surprised. I'm gonna go for the bar now and ask the sausage eggs. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing so well and I thought, Joke. Bobby, yes. <laughs> <laughs> now it's your turn. <laughs> Listen, that first half started well, didn't it? <laughs> but, um, <laughs> safe, my friend. What's your name again? <laughs> He's talking about my beard and how he wants to shag you. Lad, she is a nightmare. You can have her. <laughs> Listen, I'll 
say it properly, please do me a favour and take it off of me. <laughs> Listen, Bobby Rex, your mum has sloppy doggy sex. <laughs> What a mess. But fuck that bullshit. This battle is not competition. It's just money in the bank. Because in my God's honest opinion, you lost a dank. But this dickhead Bobby Rex is such a fucking mank. My man will spot, spot a park of coats in the street and start to bust a wank. Listen, <laughs> listen, you don't want to start, my friend. You can't pretend. You manks own more park of coats than Michael Parkinson owns park of pens. <laughs> takes his daughter swimming to the local council swimming pool and they both jump in with matching zipped up cagoules. <laughs> this fool think you're fucking with Osh. Why, Bobby? Your friends told you you could win. They lied, Bobby. I will punch you in your motherfucking eye, Bobby, on some Robocop shit. Can you fly, Bobby? <laughs> See, man, man or body, you're like... Clarence Bodica, shit, I'll body Bobby and drop his body off at the coroner. Shit, I'm safe with stars, astronomer. Listen, I'll give you this work after hours like the job's a foreigner. Listen, there's something that I've got to get across. This shit has got to be said. Whether Man United or Liverpool, if you support a team and their colour is red, you're a good for nothing cock sucking motherfucking dickhead. <laughs> He's a red devil, but the devil said to lead this red devil with a severed head. So I'll put a blade to his neck. I'll eat pieces of his flesh like a volivant. Battle rap phenomenon. Tear up at the Comic Con, reading the Necronomicon. Listen, listen. You don't want to battle one on one. Lad, I'll leave your granny fanny's holy. Beat the pussy blacker than Sammy Ami Obi. <laughs> All them mad hooligan Mancunians. Because every time I come to Manny, the welcome's always warm. I said to Bobby, What's the first thing I should do when I arrive in Manny? He said, Step off the train all alone at dawn. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> I took your mate Sally on a date. Told Sally she'd be late. Bitch started complaining. So, Sally can wait! <laughs> Listen, you look like Goldberg. <laughs> if, if, he, look, he looks like Goldberg. If instead of wrestling, he done a lot of homework. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go, 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 go. Round two, let's go, it's on Bobby. Let's go. Yeah. Instead of a rebuttal, I remembered the end of my first round. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to see it because I think the shit. It's Bobby Rex! Hey! Oh, I forgot it again, mate. Yeah. I think <laughs> shit. Story, Bobby. No, I'm joking. Listen, they told me because it's all shay, I should make sure that I've definitely prepped enough. Make sure that I don't go out the night before. Make sure that I've slept enough. Everybody's telling me to break a leg and wishing me the best of luck. And I'm like, rah. Stop putting him on a pedestal, man. He can get to fuck. He's a fit <laughs> You're a 30 year old man that's still banging to wrestling, bro. Pushing that on your son when all he wants to do is watch Paw Patrol. Give it a rest. <laughs> wrestling is for dickheads. People watch UFC these days. Real life elbow drops. Real cage. None of this. Hulkamania is coming, brother. <laughs> the Macho Man Randy Savage better be afraid. <laughs> Grow up, you fucking idiot. Act your, act your age and not your shoe size. Stop watching two guys pretend to have a scrap while they're wearing tights that are far too tight. <laughs> it's real fights these days. A bit of boxing, a bit of Muay Thai, and you better have your guard up today, O'Shea, or you'll be getting fucked up by the new guy. <laughs> So once again, it's Bobby Rex! Mancunian and proud of that, but for fuck's sake, Briggser, how many scousers do you need to see me shouting at? <laughs> I get it, you're a mank. 
and it's in your DNA to fucking hate them. But bro, I've already used up all my scouts bars. You need to find someone else to put against them. Me. <laughs> you. <laughs> You need to find someone else to put against them. Oh, I can't believe it. Anyway, you look like the type of guy that's probably been my mate for years. <laughs> like the only reason that you're here is fucking meeting me today for beers. But I think that watching wrestling is a little bit strange and weird. <laughs> I'm glad someone. I can't believe I'm choking in my biggest battle ever. Put up against it. Oh my god. Sorry, Bobby. Right, it's good, man. I reckon I should apologise. Yeah. Everybody else. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna laugh. It's actually Shuffle's line. <laughs> said it against Raptor. Um, how do you rebuttal Ryan? <laughs> ah, smack him! Shut the punch him! <laughs> so when this battle got announced online, no wonder it caused so much confusion. Bobby Rex versus O'Shea. People thought that what they saw was an illusion. One person said I didn't deserve this matchup. The rest follow suit and all jump to the conclusion that I actually don't. Like I haven't been showing that I'm already at that level and I'm ready to put that and I'm ready to Ah fuck off! Listen, he's such a fucking legend, his next matchup is battling evil. Oh shit. Oh shit, no way! Well that's set to be a classic because he's ill. I remember from that time I didn't struggle with him at all and fucking battered him free the hill. <laughs> Oh, yeah, back online. Fucking bad him 3 0. <laughs> like, is that. Why would you even do that? Just for a couple ton, maybe free bill? Is that really what you've become these days? Nothing but a cheap thrill. It's like that time that you was going to battle Luna C. They was paying him two to three grand, but they was booking you for free. And it's only because your girlfriend kicked off that don't flop produced the fee. You're not the man you used to be. And it absolutely breaks my heart because you've had over a hundred battles and you've hardly lost. Um, but. How are you not still making money? It's, I bet you wish you took that three grand now that you was offered by Charlie Sloth. Remember? Against innuendo. Two rounds rapping and one round you get in the ring and have a spar and box. But you didn't turn up. You had to ring your phone and say, Nah, it's off. <laughs> Lads, you're soft. Have you got a car? You've not. Well get back to the fucking tram stop wanker. Cause, cause ducking in your window for three grand reminds me of that time you jumped in the water, seen the shark and shit yourself. Because mate, that's not gangsta. <laughs> Woo! Fuck off. I'm so sorry that I'm running around. I'm so sorry. Round two, let's go, let's go, let's go. Listen. What the fuck? What the fuck? It's my man. This kid a proper fooling me. Congratulations, dickhead. You just messed up your biggest opportunity. <laughs> We're in Manchester. So this is like an episode of Connie for you. You feel sorry for yourself. I feel sorry for you. <laughs> Listen, so Briggsy approached me. He said, do you want to battle the newcomer of the year? Bobby Rex? I said, you damn right, Briggs. <laughs> My man quite sick. But then Briggsy and all his stinking mank mates started to celebrate and dance like this. <laughs> <laughs>
Like your mum in school. Listen, you fuck. <laughs> like your mum in school, you fucking fool. And I have that hose legs in the air like I'm playing fucking buckaroo. Listen, <laughs> fuck your crew. Listen, I don't need to prove shit. I've got a huge dick. You pronounce, you pronounce cool with cool whip. Yeah, listen, you're too shit. I'm too legit. Shake your hand. No way, mate. I'm no. Okay. Okay. If you did, I'd move it quick. Come <laughs> <laughs> Use a prick. Listen. Listen. Yeah. We got me bar again in the third round, but it doesn't matter. Because you look like matter. <laughs> if he didn't matter. If he didn't matter. <laughs> if his bones were fatter. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, <laughs> listen, I'm Funkadelic. Your crew just doesn't get it. Half your bars are about booting someone's head in. Not me though, I'm living La Vida Loca, ripping the beast it's over. Listen, bars give hematomas to any MC that wanna step in my direction. Step back, get back, for your own protection. I'm big headed like women, giving a bit of attention. <laughs> School and fool MCs, sticking them in detention. See my words are weapons, I'll save them brethren. I'm covered in green like Veda Bremen. Listen, <laughs> I bounce the street with German shepherds, dogs, dogs. <laughs> Listen, you fucking dickhead. Listen. Time for sorry, sorry, fuck that. Shut up, you cunt! <laughs> I'm actually pretty good if he's right. I fucked up my chance. Not only that, I'm such an idiot, I joined in with the fucking. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Listen, I'm <laughs> now for this round, forget the battle off. I want to speak to the man. And a little word of warning for you, Stephen. This is where it gets peak for you, fam. <laughs> See, I'm about to make everything irrelevant that this little knobhead says. Because if you go on his girlfriend's page on Facebook, you'll find that her name is Flossy Rex. Wait a minute. Flossy Rex. And you haven't even reacted, Stephen. It's like you think that that's okay. No way! Bro, your girlfriend's called herself Flossy Rex. How come she ain't called Flo Shay? <laughs> <laughs> and there's something you're gonna do. I mean, it's alright your girlfriend's got a crush, but shouldn't that crush just be on you? Like last month at ABW, somebody even said that I was fucking her, and although that stuff ain't true, from the way that she was behaving, I'm not surprised they thought that she'd be down for it. Only reason it didn't happen is not because I respect that it's your girlfriend, it's because I would never fuck a scouser chick. <laughs> Saddest thing about it is, he got told his girlfriend's fucking another battler in this league and he never even doubted it. Oh, I'm such a mouthy prick. <laughs> Maybe I should tone it down a bit. What if O starts getting mad and wants to throw his weight around a bit? Let him fucking try, I'll smash his face in with a council brick. Then I'll, <laughs> then, yeah? then I'll get out my dick and get his girlfriend bouncing up and down on it. So which one is it? Would a fucker? Would a not? Ooh. Guess you'll find out when you walk in the room and I say, Oh, you fucking knob, you should have knocked. And he'll, hey! he'll probably shrug it off. Like I tell you what, Bobby, I don't even care, you fucking floss. Only thing I need to know, only thing I need to know is if I'm gonna watch how much it's gonna cost. <laughs> Dirty fucking bastard. Guy's been double crossed and he ain't even gonna leave her. He's just insisting for at least another week she doesn't wash. <laughs> and this whole time she'll be in his ear going, Stee, I swear it, he is fucking boss. <laughs> Mate, you need to fuck her off. And I never came. Breaking up your relationship is 
not what I came to do. But if she's already done that to win your window, what's to say that she won't do the same to you? Woo! To be honest, that's such an old and tired angle that I thought you'd all boo me. <laughs> His girlfriend's called Flossie. According to this dyslexic cunt, her name is actually Flooza. Uh, oh, I, I didn't deliver it. I didn't deliver it as good as I wanted to. The pressure is unreal. I've got a mouth. I've got such a dry mouth. I swear, you should see how my gums feel. And also, do you remember like I said in the first round, how they gave me advice and said. Don't go out last night. Well, I did, and that's the reason that I fucked up. And that's time. <laughs>